will, would, would like, and would like to. What's the difference among the following words? Will, would, would like, and would like to. Which of the following has the same meaning as the first sentence? I intend to be there. I would like to attend the seminar. I would attend the seminar. I will attend the seminar. Think about it. I will attend the seminar. Which has the same meaning? I have a desire to go. I would like to attend. I would attend. I will attend. I would like to attend the seminar. I probably won't go. I would like to attend. I would attend. I will attend. I would attend the seminar. Predicting the future is not something we can do with 100% accuracy. It's nearly impossible because the future is uncertain. However, we can talk about our desires, intentions, and some possibilities for the future. When we talk about future possibilities, we use will to indicate plans or intentions. For example, I'll put the black ball in the right pocket. Note, be going to or be gonna indicates a stronger intention. For near impossibilities, we use would. For example, I would go to your party, but I have another obligation. That means it's probably not going to happen. I won't be at your party. Once in a while, would is used in future conditional situations. For example, if I have time tomorrow, I will visit you. There's a real possibility that that will happen. I might see you. If I had time, I would visit you. This is an unreal situation. I won't have time to see you. It's not going to happen. When we talk about the desire to have something, we use would like or would like. I'd like a cup of coffee, please. This is a request. If we change it into a question, it can be an offer. For example, would you like a cookie? Would you like some tea? When we talk about a desire to do something, we use would like to. For example, I'd like to take you to dinner on Friday. We're unsure of the outcome in this situation. It depends on your response. If we change this into a question, it becomes a polite invitation. For example, would you like to go? Accepting invitations. Would you like to go bowling this weekend? Yes, I would. Or I would like to. When you say, sure, I'd love to, that's a very enthusiastic, positive response. Invitations with will can be tricky. For example, Will you go to the dance? That means, will you be there at the event? But if you want to invite someone, you can say, will you go to the event with me? Let's look at an example of how we use these. 
Are you going to the dance? That's just asking if you're going to be there. I'm not sure. Would you like to go with me? Yes, I'd love to. Let's check your skills. What's the best answer to the question? Who can help me with the dishes? I will. I would. The best answer is I will. We can also say I can. Would you like to go fishing this weekend? Yes, I will. Yes, I would. Yes, I would like. Which is the best answer? Yes, I would. I buy your ticket, but I don't have enough money. Will, would, would like. Would. Hope that was helpful. Now you know how to use these expressions correctly. Remember to practice. That's all for today on Say It Right in English. Thanks for watching. For more videos like these, check out the links below youtube.com at English Free For You or eslgold.com slash h-u-m-i-x. You can also check out our websites for more free English learning resources, eslgold.com and freeenglishstudy.com.